What if there is no tomorrow? There wasn't one today. What's up guys, Wonder Win here. I bring you a standard battle I got from my live stream versus Logan, aka Star Master 778. Um, he asked for standard, so I brought it. Oh, you team. So um, he will be playing the role of the challenger, and I will be playing the role of the OU whore. So I'm start off with Lee Medgrove, since that's what I do. That's what he's supposed to do is lead off. Um, I'm not sure what this Rose Ray is going to do. He does not put me to sleep, which I find kind of strange. And I just get a meteor mash off, uh, hit it to his focus dash, and now it's gone because I'm going to finish it off with a bullet punch. So I'm looking good already. Six, uh, it's, you know, five, it's six five, and you know, I'm looking pretty healthy. He's going to bring out Dragonite that kind of looks like Yoshi, but it isn't a Yoshi because I have the Yoshi. So what are you doing? And uh, I'm going to go ahead and take this time to set up Stuff Rocks. I figured that he might want to EQ. He's got that plus one. He's got that big plus one. And um, EQ is definitely super effective against, uh, what's this thing called, Metagross. <laughs> so um, I'm just going to go ahead and switch out the Glycor, uh, Gliscor, wow, really? <laughs> switch out the Gliscor predicting the Earthquake, but he just goes for another dance. I'm like, uh oh, this is not good. I'm going to go ahead and Ice Fang him just in case he wants to go for another one. Hopefully he does not. Um, he does go for the Outrage in a plus two. Uh, life orb outrage wow man um glass you are you are you are a wall man took that like nothing yeah yeah almost killed me in one hit so that's definitely not good that is that thing is a threat right now so i'm gonna save glass because he can potentially help me later i'm going to uh metagross who can definitely take the outrage a little bit better i got that priority bullet punch and i was hoping hoping that he would be in that uh, amount of health where i could finish him off with a bullet punch but he lives with a smidgen half a quarter of a third of a smidgen and um he's gonna be able to finish me off with another outrage but he does finish himself off with a life orb and that's gonna be a double down he's gonna go into his embry palm i'm like i'm gonna go to my infernate which are coincidentally both also good leads to start off with but i'm fearing it um fake out i don't want to take any unnecessary damage so i'm gonna go to jealous who can take that like it's his job and in in this instance it is his job so good job jealous and he's gonna get that scald off as i get taunted and Ah, that's cool. I'm not gonna will the for you because uh, two skulls will take you out. And I'm gonna try that second skull to take him out. He's gonna switch to his crack sire, and um, I'm gonna get that big crick. Uh, and I am that big sorry, but uh, j uh, crack sire ain't nothing to joke with. So um, I think he'd be able to take another one. I'm gonna, go I'm gonna try to go for the skull. Should have probably went for the shadow ball since that would been more base power. And uh, but should have. I mean, I should have. I, I should have done that, but I didn't. I went with the skull just in case he would have switched out or something. And he's going to get that big swagger on me. I'm be confuzzled. And I don't like being confuzzled, so I'm going to switch out, uh, predicting that he's going to recover on this turn. So this turn, Glasgow can possibly get some leftover, uh, some Poison Hill lefties, lunch, something. Okay, and then uh, I can bait the water move and just go back to Jellicent, who, again, takes this like it's his job, right? And in this instance, it is its job again. So, Jellison, you're doing doing work, son. So, since I'm faster, I know I can get a will o -Wisp off if I hit. And I do hit, so that's good. And he's going to get his Toxic off, so he's giving the gift that keeps on giving. And I... Um, is sitting here looking I'm still looking pretty good so um maybe two shadow balls can take this thing out uh, but he's gonna switch out I'm just scald and he's gonna go to his glaceon which uh it's gonna take about 25% from that um step rock damage and then a shadow ball so um it's not looking too good it can take one more hit um if he switches out now it can survive one more step rock entry so I would definitely switch it out but he's gonna go for that super effective shadow ball which I think I predicted I'm pretty sure I did or I just didn't really want to play around with the poison and Jellicent would be helpful uh, throughout the game so I thought about that too. So I go into infinite, um, I'm going to go for that big, uh, stop saying that big, I'm going to go for the close combat and it's going to be 2 hit KO on this Quagsire from this distance plus the burn damage so um, I definitely don't have anything to worry about that. It doesn't have any priority and so it's not i don't have to worry about it after speeding me i do go for the hidden power ice i believe just in case in case he wants to switch out uh i don't know why i did ice because who would that would hit the dragonite that's already dead right i know right and um so he's gonna go in his ambry palm i could switch out go back to jellison if i really wanted to care about score which i don't uh but i just because he doesn't have rocks up, so I could have switched back to Jealous and not take the fake out again completely while his um, Ember Pump. Kind of like I do now. Uh, I am going to go into 
jealousy. He's gonna go for the uh, substitute. I don't. I'm not sure why with this move because um, he doesn't really have any moves to hit me. He has double hit and he has fake out. He has taunt and then uh, break break or something. I feel low kick. He has some kind of move like that and this jealousy completely walls him. So he's just gonna taunt me so I can't recover. I can't really risk. I have to finish him off with skull. He's gonna double hit just to you know speed up the process. And uh, I'm gonna finish it off with that skull. And Jellison is doing work, son. Jellison, <laughs> sons and daughters. Jellison is doing work. Um, Mrs. Big Head, thank you. I appreciate your services. It's uh, definitely been helpful in this match. Um, Glacier is gonna come out, barely survive the Steph Rock entry. I'm gonna finish it off with a Shadow Ball or a Skull. I can't remember. I wasn't looking. I looked back for a second, and it was dead. I'm like, what? What just happened? So I'm gonna survive with five HP. And not, not too big of a deal, it's just long enough for me to figure out what's going on. He's going to go to his last Pokemon, which is Heat Train. He's going to go for that Dragon Pulse, and that's definitely going to take me out. I don't think Jellicent is that balling to take a Dragon Pulse at level 5 and still survive the poison. And I'm going to come out with Lucario, because I suck at nicknames. I named it Walker, because he's going to loop Skywalker. Yeah, it's dumb. Uh -huh. I know what? It's dumb. I know. So, uh, I'm going to do that Aura Spear. He's going to survive. Not a big surprise. He's going to finish me off with a Lava Plume, and I'm going to go into Gliscor. See, I kept handy this entire time. And he's going to finish him off with an EQ. So, that was a good game, Logan. Star Master 778. Definitely go check him out. I had fun. Get, you know, we're going to do it again sometime. Um, peace, guys. That's all I got. Don't really have a lot to say. It's cold as crap. I'm going to go get in the bed and, and watch a movie or something. But, um, like that, we out.